This is a life hack how to tenderize meat that may be tougher that you're about to cook. Take some steak spice, put it in a bowl, take another bowl, put a little oil in the bowl just to lube the tip of a fork. And all you wanna do is take a fork, get some steak spice to stick to the fork and then stab it into the meat. And this way, you get the spices into the meat to tenderize it as it cooks. You wanna isolate the steak spice from the rest of the steak spice so that you don't cross contaminate an entire jar of steak spice. Just wet the tip a little bit, stab the spices in. This way the spices go into the meat. The fork holes create little conduits for heat to pass through the meat as you cook it so it actually cooks it fuller and throughher. And then the excess that's on the other side, just rub it into the meat like that. Flip it over, get it wet, boom. Get a little oil on the tip of the fork. Get the tips of the fork covered in steak spice. Insert with force. But for like shoulder blade or meat that is not prime cut, this is a great way to tenderize it. And that is your cooking life hack for the day. You want to get the right order, right? It's the oil, spice, then steak, not vice versa. I'm just doing it wrong again. Oil, spice, steak. Oil, spice, steak. And then when you're all done, mix the oil and the spice. Peace out.